Public Schools is excited to offer paid internships this summer to our own students. We have hired them to work as custodians in our bus garage and in our public relations department. Here's what they are saying about the program. This summer, 35 Burke County Public Schools students are gaining a course credit for working an internship through several different businesses, and eight of those interns are working directly at Burke County Public Schools. The internship is a 10-week period with many interns starting work at 6 a.m. through 3 p.m., Monday through Thursday, getting paid $8.25 an hour with about 25 hours per week. For most interns, it's a helpful step into the real world because it builds a resume and experience. I found out about it when I was doing a, because I got a drone to do a firefighting class, and uh, my chief told me about it, so I went and filled out for it. And I thought it would be a great idea for me to get a job and get to meet some new people, just help the communities. I found out it through my carpentry teacher over at Freedom. He had asked me if I wanted a summer job, and I said sure, so I had filled out the paperwork right before. And when I was signing up for classes, it was on the shoe. Better than getting out there at 12 o'clock because it gets hot. And it doesn't bother me that much. I mean, I usually have to wake up early anyways to go and do house chores, so. It's easier, in my opinion. I really wasn't knowing what to expect as far as what to do coming here as far as job-wise. Like, I figured, of course, it was going to have to do something, of course, with the buses. I wanted to be a mechanic, and okay. that's partly one of the reasons I decided to go with the bus garage. How about you, Alex? Firefighter. Uh, take my dog to the vet, but besides <laughs> getting a few books and a few games, I'm going to save the rest of it. Gas money. I'm just happy I got to do this. Yeah, me too. I'm happy that I was able to do something for the community and actually be a part of something. So, but I get to meet these two guys. Uh, we appreciate the opportunity to have the interns here this year. We've got three outstanding interns. Uh, it's a hot, hard job washing the buses, but they've done an excellent job. They come in at 6 a.m. in the morning and work till 12 o'clock, clean the inside out of the buses. So it's fall when the buses start out in August, all the clean buses, you can thank our interns this year. We appreciate the opportunity to have them here this year. Yeah, it's great. I, the people I work with are great. It's awesome. I'd like to get into welding or something. Carpentry, because I took that class. It's actually my carpentry teacher is the one that uh, showed me this. So. It's been wonderful. If I can give me about 20 more grants, I'd have it made. I love grant. Bring me some more grants. I was just in fire uh, in fire tech with Trailway, and he got a call from Miss Norton asking if there's anybody in his classes that was looking for a, a summer job or just something to do with summer. Didn't happen. I was like, okay, I'm looking for a job. It's paid internship. Woo! All in one. <laughs> Two birds, one stone. When the students come back, I guess it'll give you kind of a sense of pride to know that you helped get the building ready for all of them. And I watch you get dirty all through the whole school. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I won't be like that. I'm probably more tired and everything else like I normally am to the school year. Preferably good into my career is full-time fire with Hickory okay. and Morganton or whichever one's hiring at the time. We are very pleased to have Matthew working with us this year. Uh, he's been an exceptional worker. He has a good attitude very punctual, and does a great job, and we're tickled. <laughs>